Dakota first. Welcome back. Easter church service looked a little different last year because of the pandemic. It was online because people couldn't gather. As vaccinations continue to roll out, though, this year's service looked a little like years past. Caressa Stinchcomb shares more. It's just exciting. I think it's just fun to be where we're at now um, versus a year ago. Hundreds of churchgoers made their way through the Pursuit Church Easter Sunday. Last year, service was online. Some people I spoke to say the gathering today felt like a 180 from last year. When you have a gathering in person, um, there's just a different atmosphere. There's just a different connection you have with people with God. It was hard not having that connection with people that can only happen in person. For some churchgoers, this was their first time back since large gatherings were shut down. This will be the largest gathering we've seen since March 10th, March 13th. Whatever Sunday that was, um, of people gathering together, and it's exciting. It's, it's good to see the faces you haven't seen in a long time. I'm just really happy to have everybody here with us. Yeah, for sure. I do feel like there's so many people that are coming in um, for, over these last couple of weeks um, that we haven't seen in so long. So it really is something special. Yeah, it does. It just kind of seems like almost like a breakthrough. You know, like we made it. We things that seem to be coming around and it just feels good to be back. They say today feels like a step in the right direction, and there's light at the end of the tunnel. Definitely a new normal, uh, you know, so I think, but I'm definitely feeling that, and you know, today it definitely feels like how it has felt in past years, so I think with the, you know, everything, with the vaccinations and everything, I think people are just feeling more comfortable coming yeah. in. There's loving to see them, so. The Pursuit continues to offer their service online for those who don't feel comfortable gathering. For KX News in Minot, I'm Caressa Stinchcomb. Now the CDC guidance for a large gathering still includes wearing a mask, keeping a six foot distance, and avoiding crowded, poorly ventilated indoor spaces. Stay with us. Still to come on KX News. I think you 